beautiful artwork made out of Lego. We couldn't believe what we just saw here. Lori Wallace is live at the Bricking Bad exhibit. Hi, Lori. Hey, you guys. Yeah, I'm blown away by, away by this. This is David Tracy from East Sacramento, a Christian Brothers grad, so a local guy nice. who is doing some of the coolest artwork, seriously, you've ever seen. So, David, I've been talking to you. You've been giving me the backstory on all these Lego bricks, and we're going to get there. But these lamps are one of the most probably common things that you do now. Yep. Talk a little bit about how you got started and how Legos as a kid evolved into this. Absolutely. Uh, I, it almost started, I think, when... In college, I was studying architecture at UCLA. My mom came to me and said, I have all these pieces. I think I'd like to, to move them out. That was so nice of her to, to talk to you about it first. And I said, hold on one second. Let me see what I can do with them first. And uh, then we started brainstorming. She sent me over a couple of photos from Architectural Digest. And I got to thinking, uh, the next thing I knew, I was building a really cool Lego lamp. And from there, I have... <laughs> built quite a few more. <laughs> he's built some lamps, guys. Okay, oh, yeah. <laughs> take a look around. This is just one table of some of the lamps that he's done. And this is wow. just a small sample of the artwork that he does. So uh, I was talking to David a little bit about the longest amount of time he's spent on one piece in particular. And it's this guy over here. Tell us about this. So this is Pensive, as I call him. He is a six-foot-tall Lego man. And it took me about four months of continuous work to get him done. Wow. It's about 70,000 bricks inside of this oh, guy. 70,000 oh bricks. Gosh. I think I have 70,000 spare bricks lying around my you house do. that I <laughs> would like to <laughs> donate do. to David. I would like to <laughs> give them to I'm sure he I could do something amazing. Him. You do? Okay, good. All right, let's keep walking and looking around because look at the lamps on this table, you guys. These are a little more elaborate than the ones that we saw up front. Yeah, yeah. So these are the ones up front. It's called a splash of color. I did those in the rainbow series colors. This, these are all black and white. This was my sort of attempt to do something more modern, oh, sophisticated, and see what I could do with the form okay. rather than yeah. the color. Yeah. And there's a little bit of a backstory on a couple of these guys. Yep. So the uh, this lamp here that has a black to white gradient. Uh, this is the original piece, and I sold a copy of this to the Lego Movie. And then the other piece at the end of the table, which I call a Taurus lamp is another piece that you're seeing the original here, and the Lego Movie also owns a copy of that oh, lamp. That is cool. Okay, we only have about 45 more seconds, and I want to talk to him way longer, so we're going to go and fast forward now. Okay, <laughs> all the food here, the Lego food. Uh, tell us about that, and while you're doing that, let's walk this way, because we got to show them the uh, Wonder Woman stuff. Tell me about the food. Absolutely. So the food I did for Taste Made magazine, I built it live on air. And uh, you I can come that. here and see the finished products. I got to keep oh. those, so I bring those out for display. And then if you're inspired <laughs> to, you can go check it out on Tastemade's Facebook page when you're done. Okay, and just because we have to show the rest of this here, Wonder Woman, you're known for all this Wonder Woman art. Tell me about this. So the Wonder Woman pieces I did with Judith Tondra, who is the, uh, the artist that draws Wonder Woman for DC Comics. I met her when I was in Hungary this last summer for a project with a school that I, I help with there. And we decided to do this Wonder Woman mural set because we wanted to explore doing some pop culture art that kind of melded both of our artistic talents. Love that. It is amazing. Thank you so much for sharing it with us this morning. The exhibit Breaking Bad is going on this weekend and next weekend. So we got to see some really cool Lego art. And Scott Holcomb got all his steps in in just this one segment. <laughs> <laughs> we got it all knocked out. <laughs> Well, that is amazing stuff. That is really yeah. neat. All right. I love he's from here. Yeah, from that's here. great. Yeah, it's awesome. Thanks, Lori. Hey, if you would like to eat healthy.